She, you were going to stand here, you were going to blow a bubble, and then using your breath only, you going to blow the bubble through the hula hoop. See if it's a really terrible disease where your mucus essentially coats your lungs so that you can't breathe fully. So this game just through blowing bubbles we're demonstrating like those of us that don't have the disease like that we have the ability to breathe and exhale fully through the bubbles. And that just sort of represents sort of maybe what we take for granted for those who can't use their lungs to their full capacity. Well, it's our grad service project week, so every year the grade 12 class votes on a charity or organization that we want to raise money for. So this year was uh, Canadian, the Canadian CF organization for cystic fibrosis. So every, all the teams have been doing a lot of fundraising, and this is our challenge week, where you just do games and activities to sort of reinforce what we've been doing. You know what, we've done this, it's a Notre Dame tradition. So we've done this for years. So students know about this when they come to us. Their perhaps older brothers and sisters have been involved. It's a bit of a bragging thing to see who can raise the most money. They want to beat last year. That's kind of the goal every year. Uh, but it's just something that the kids get involved in and, and nice to give back to the community and, and do something a little bit different, not just in a classroom. They go in the community, they talk fa to families. There, was a, there have been movie nights, there's been food truck wars, uh, lots of babysitting in the community and they donate lots of bottle drives. Any way they can uh, raise dollars. Car washes, the weather's agreeable, so car washes is a big one. Any way they can raise dollars to, to contribute to the charity. To me it's, it's all about volunteering and trying to help out the people around us that don't, like, they can't function as well so it's us relating to them like this year I believe it is $65,000 is what we're trying to raise. I definitely think that it brings the school together because the grade 10s and the 11s get involved with the service groups like in my service group I think I believe we have two or three grade 11s that are being part of it and it's it's a good way for them to get involved and kind of see what to do when they hit grade 12 and are part of the service project and give them ideas for different things to do for their grad service project. Like it's, it's sort of a fun way to interpret something that really is a terrible disease, but it's just raising awareness for it because it, like, the disease itself isn't very recognized.